And now, your weather authority, Ron Young. Certified the most accurate forecast in the Arklatex. This is a weather ready day and this is one mess of a radar right now. We've got so many warnings and special weather statements. We'll start off in southwest Arkansas and all of the severe thunderstorm warnings contain 60 mile an hour winds and for the most part ping pong ball sized hail and moving off to the northeast, east northeast at about 45 miles an hour. Starting off in southwest Arkansas being uh, Columbia, Shelby, or Columbia, Lafayette, Miller, and Nevada counties. That includes the Texarkana area all the way into Nevada County, which is up towards Prescott and uh, over towards the Stamps area. This is serious business with large hail, and that's what we had expected out of this. Tornado threat is very low, but you can't totally rule it out. But so far, this has been nothing but hailers with some fairly high winds and the hail part could eventually, but I don't think it's going to happen in our area, two inch hail, no, but we've had one inch hail or so, so far. Now then getting into uh, Webster and also Claiborne Parish that we've got here until 645. Then we have Bienville, Bossier, Caddo, DeSoto, Sabine, Panola and Shelby counties, that is these storms also moving off to the east northeast, also with 60 mile an hour winds and some large hail there. Ping pong ball size likely with most of these storms moving again, about getting across now Sabine River and Toledo Bend. We'll continue to watch this very closely. Hopefully we will not get any tornado warnings, just severe thunderstorm warnings with, as we mentioned, over the weekend or into the weekend and Friday, two inch hail is what they're talking about a possibility of. And again, all of Southwest Arkansas, almost all of Northwest Louisiana and from Bowie County right down the state line, but also including Sabine and also the uh, area here and back to Nacogdoches. We will be watching this very closely. As far as high temperatures today, unbelievable. Texarkana, 93 degrees, a lot of humidity and instability. That goes without saying. 90 in Shreveport with 89 in Mansfield, 86 in Magnolia, 89 as we head into the Marshall area. Going all the way up to DeQueen, 86, 90 in center, yeah, it is tough. Humidity levels, they are up there. Absolutely wind speeds between 10 and 20 miles an hour. And we have gusts of 24 to 26 miles an hour all the way up to Ida Bell and in Texarkana right now. So the wind is a problem. Wind gusts are up there as well. So we are gonna see wind gusts on your Sunday. Look at this. We're gonna see a northwest wind and sunshine but they're gonna be gusts up to 30 miles an hour. Here is our enhanced risk, Northwest Louisiana, almost all of Southwest Arkansas, surrounded by a slight risk. And again, hail and high winds. And this is what we're looking at. Excuse me, let me go back to that very quickly. This is gonna push through quickly. By Sunday midnight, it's out of here. We've got clearing skies. And as we go on into your Sunday, Clear skies, northwest winds, high pressure will scoot off to our east and we have a return of some southerly winds. And as we go into your Tuesday, we'll still see mostly clear skies, but headed into 7 p.m., we start to see clouds increase and we may see a few showers on your Wednesday. And this is when we may see by your Thursday, a slight chance of severe storms once again. So we'll watch this closely. We could pick up some fairly significant rain as we go through this system, but here is your seven day forecast with tomorrow sunshine, 71, 46 and 79. Big chill here. We start to warm back up. Wednesday's a 50% chance. Storms on Thursday, they could be severe with Friday, 50% chance of storms and Saturday cooling down a bit once again with some nice weather. We'll be right back. 